Hello everyone and welcome to Warm Summary on Reinsurance. This is part 5 where we are talking about uh, the topic on policy access. Okay. So, the policy access, actually the idea doesn't involve the reinsurer but we still have this kind of policy in this reinsurance chapter because the way to calculate the statistical value, the expect value, the variance is very similar to a reinsurance framework. So let's see. In policy access, the policy holder act like the 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 direct insurer in in uh, excess of loss reinsurance where the first part of loss will be reimbursed by re uh, by the policy holder and for direct insurer for for insurer in policy excess they will act like reinsurer in uh, excess of loss reinsurance so let me visualize a little bit here okay so let's say in Excess of loss. Say you have excess of loss of ten thousand, ten thousand, and then a claim of fifteen thousand occur. So direct insurer, direct insurer, are going to pay for the third part, which is. 10k right and then the rest of them the 5k go to reinsurer okay and for policy excess with excess of 10k and the same claim amount happen 15k the first part gonna pay by the policy holder The rare has go to insurer. Okay, so it's the same. Can you use the same formula? Just change the name of the party, right? Okay. So that's how we're working with a uh, policy access. Okay, let's have a look in the uh, our problem about this chapter. In this. In this problem, we are go. We are asked to find the risk premium of a policy with excess of thousand hundred pound, and the original loss have a Pareto. So let's say original loss have Pareto alpha two point five and lambda five thousand. Okay. And here we have a word risk premium. Risk premium is premium. That calculate and ignore expense. So no commission, no blah 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 blah. Just a peak value of loss. Okay, risk premium. Okay, so this is this one. For this one, we want a potential reduction. So. Let's first begin with if there are no if there are no um no excess first. So if there are no excess e of x okay gonna be just lambda over alpha take away one right for Pareto and now if we have the excess the loss or let's say the new one the loss for for us, if there is excess, let's say it's x, and I use this one here, okay? x with excess of 100. So, e of x, 100. Uh, let's say, let's do the y instead because we are insured. So, it will be more consistent with previous part, okay? Okay, so. We are going to pay the loss that excess of 100. So 
its formula for the reinsurer for excess of law is that x take away 100 and then f of x alpha lambda to the power of alpha uh, lambda plus x to the power of alpha plus 1 dx okay and here we just do u substitution of x take away 100 we call it new the new variable y so y going to form zero from to from zero to infinity and this one the numerator be the same the denominator we have x here so we are gonna have lambda plus y plus 100 right and then the x still then what we are going to do is we just pull this one out okay and we adjust a little bit by lambda plus 100 we multiply in and then we divide it out so it's neutralized to one and the second part is just another parallel from zero to infinity and expectation so we finally have this one multiplied by lambda here is lambda plus 100 and alpha take away one okay so just try the percentage reduction so what we want is the expectation of original loss okay original uh, reduction or well, maybe we better use the the one with excess on the top so it will be some 90 something percent okay here is with excess and then with our excess is this one and then we have we have lambda to the power of alpha lambda plus 100 to the power of alpha multiply uh, lambda plus 100 and alpha minus 1 just cancel out so we have lambda here and then we just substitute lambda is 5000 over 5000 plus 1 for 5100 5, alpha 255 multiply 5100 over 5000 and this will give us of 0 0.97 or 7 so with uh, excess of loss introduced into a policy the reduction of loss, the reduction of risk premium is reduced. Risk premium by 2.93%. Okay. And that is for policy excess. Thank you.